When it comes to CSS, there are two ways to implement CSS code onto your website. One way is to use code directly onto the HTML document, or we can link CSS code from an external CSS style sheet to the HTML document. In this video, we will cover how to link an external style sheet. To do that, we need to use link tags. The link tag should go within the head element of the HTML document, and that's because we want the CSS styling to load first before any elements are presented on the screen. If you place the link tag after the elements in HTML, then the styling will cause the elements to reload on the screen with the desired styling, which will lead to a slower web page. The link tag consists of three different attributes, href, type, and rel. href simply specifies the path where the external style sheet is located. In this example, I placed a style sheet called index.css within a folder called CSS, which is located in the root directory. With that said, I can use this path to show where the style sheet is. Type just describes what kind of document is being linked to the web page. Since this is a CSS style sheet, the value for this type attribute should be text slash CSS. The rel attribute describes the relationship between the HTML document to what is being linked. With the CSS style sheets, the value for the rel attribute should be style sheet. Also, the link tag is not a typical HTML tag because the link tag is a self-closing element, meaning it takes on this syntax instead of the traditional tag syntax. Now you may be asking, why should I use external style sheets? There are many reasons to do this. One is for convenience. Let's say you reuse CSS styling across multiple web pages. For this scenario, it is better to have one CSS file and link it to different web pages instead of pasting the CSS code onto each page. Plus it allows you to change CSS code in one place and have it update the styling across multiple pages at once. Another reason is because it decreases web page loading times. When a new visitor enters your website, their browsers will store external CSS files. So when they enter different web pages on your website, their browsers do not have to look for the style sheets because they have them already stored. If you coded CSS directly onto the HTML document, then there's no way that the browser knows there is CSS code until the user clicks on the page and loads it. So this CSS code will have to be loaded each time when a user visits a page. Lastly, having external style sheets allows you to be more organized. It may not be totally necessary for small amounts of CSS, but when it comes to larger websites, external CSS files will save you time because you have the ability to organize the CSS by web pages, different sections of the website, or even global styling that appears across multiple web pages. So that's how you link external style sheets and what benefits that come along with it.